Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new Ninjago video here on the channel. My name is Tanner Fishies. In today's video, I thought it could be fun to showcase all three types of Ninjago tournament ninja for the Ninjago franchise. On the left, we have a 2015 Tournament of Elements Tournament Ninja. In the middle, we have a Ninjago Legacy Tournament Ninja. And on the far right, we have the newest rendition of the tournament design, a Source Tournament Ninja. My goal for today's video is to compare and contrast every single type of Tournament Ninja. We are not going to be showcasing every single tournament minifigure ever, as I do not have the majority of the Dragons Rising Season 2 Part 2 sets. So for the time being, let's just focus on Tournament Lloyd, shall we? Let's start with the original then we will go down the line from there so starting things off we have ourselves a 2015 tournament of elements tournament ninja minifigure now these minifigures had a very simplistic and straightforward design i feel like though that is not a bad thing i feel like it definitely worked for the time later suits would probably require more detail and they got more detail but these are not that bad they had some excellent torso printing featuring every single one of the ninja's symbols along with the respect Perspective ninja symbol in the top left hand corner there top right for them we also had some awesome back printing ignore the cracked legs on my minifigure here that's what happens when lego gets old but the back printing was also pretty sweet featuring the ninja's elemental symbol not to mention we had the traditional half mask and hair combo which is very common with the tournament minifigures in fact every single tournament ninja that will be showcased in this video has that exact same format not to mention the sleeveless look and the black gloves that carries through throughout all of them as well overall i like the original tournament ninja they are iconic they are classic every adjective in between however dare i say some of the other tournament minifigures do it maybe just a tiny bit better enter the ninjago legacy tournament designs which were very much trying to be an update or at least some type of modern upgrade to the original tournament designs as you can see they are rather similar the new ones are just a tiny bit more again modern more streamlined a little bit more detail as well well, not as clunky, I'll say, as the originals. Same deal with the back printing. The back printing, again, is also rather similar to what came before, just updated and modernized for the current Ninjago Legacy audience. These suits never appeared in the show, and they probably never will appear in the show, but overall, I do think these suits are pretty fantastic all across the board. In my opinion, they are a huge upgrade to the originals, even though the originals, again, they are classic iconic whatever you want to say but the legacy ones in my opinion just do the job a whole lot better and here we go last and definitely not least we have the ninjago dragons rising season 2 source tournament ninja designs which like i said before are rather similar to those that came before for example the hairpiece half mask combo with the sleeveless attire with black gloves however the source tournament design takes it a step further by giving the ninja a shoulder pad which is a brand new piece for this year and it looks really really good the back printing let's take a look at that super quick as well is similar to what we saw before with the other tournament ninja having a symbol on the back only this time every ninja has their respective source dragon and their original elemental symbol the rest of the figure is also printed extremely well with a lot of excellent detail throughout almost like dragon scales which i think is really cool not to mention we have each symbol down there in the bottom right uh, bottom left for them and we have some ninjargon written on here which actually says master of whatever their element is so for lloyd for example it says moe meaning master of energy overall very fantastic figures i love these ones quite a bit these are definitely my favorites out of the entire tournament selection thus far of course the other ones are iconic nostalgic everything in between but i feel like the source tournament ninja they just add so much to the already awesome tournament concept it's hard not to love them and in terms of how I would rank them honestly I feel like they just get better as they go along I feel like all of these have something amazing about them but the source tournament ninja designs I think those just encapsulate everything awesome about the tournament ninja concept and with that being said that'll pretty much wrap it up for my thoughts here thank you so much for tuning in leave all of your thoughts down below in the comments what did you think about this showcase of all three types of tournament ninja and which of these three do you prefer which one do you think does the tournament concept best Leave all your thoughts down below, and thank you so much for tuning in. If you guys enjoyed this one, feel free to like and subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I will talk to you guys again very, very soon. Peace.